Did you ever consider how all of this would impact Ireland or did you and do you care? Oh, I do. And I think ultimately Ireland will leave the European Union too. Uh, I don't think the European Union Sorry, will even exist Sorry, can I just stop you there? The latest, I, the latest poll figure yeah. I have on that is 88% of yeah. people who were asked here in Ireland okay, said good. that they would very stay good. in the EU. So that's not going to happen and it's not very on good. the cards. No, just as... No, no, no. Just as you were all going to vote for the Lisbon Treaty, but in the end you didn't. You uh, voted against the Lisbon Treaty. You were forced to vote again. The European no, hang Union on a second. The Lisbon Treaty was not passed the first time. You are right. It was renegotiated. Yeah. Ireland won some reassurances on, so on sovereignty. So what was presented yeah. to the Irish people the second time was yeah. not, in fact, the same. Yeah, well, it was all just me. It was all completely meaningless anyway. Look, all over Europe, what you are seeing is the growth of real opposition to this project. The idea that Europe's laws should be set and made by a group of unelected old men in Brussels, it's an idea whose time has passed. And I, I don't just want the UK out of the European Union, I want Europe out of the European Union. I want a Europe of sovereign democratic states working and trading closely together. But this current system will not stand the test of time, believe you me.